Today we're gonna do some fishing, but first, some spear fishing. check this out race and myself just came back to the same spot we scouted about two days ago um it's really cool we just pull up and there's a bunch of birds diving and there's this huge bait ball um i think a lot of fish pushed it in that's why the bait is there so we're gonna give it a go and it's definitely feeling good about it let's check it out Oh, <laughs> a little one cast on the next one, cast on the next one! Oh, you cast behind him. Reese, what was that to us? Yeah. Is that blue one? Is that good eating fish too, boy? <laughs> yes, Reese! You can check out! Yeah. I don't know if that blue one or yellow, Jack. Right there, right there sitting on us. Oh, right there. Right, 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 Cast on my lure, cast on my lure. No, you're gonna pull your lure on. Oh! Oh, he tried it. Oh, he missed it. Oh! Oh, he tried it. Oh, he missed it. Oh my god. Did I, I didn't even see him come in, us. I didn't even see him come in. Did you see him by my lure? It was a big snooker. Yeah, I think I'm pretty sure it was over. It looked like it hit it hit the lure on it just Yeah boy. I didn't even see him coming on. Oh he didn't hook there you Oh my god I cannot believe that I just had a trophy snuck come up and smash my lure and I missed the hook up. I'm not taking blame for that. That fish missed that lure. Ah, that was the fish we came here for. Ah, that that one hurt. Anyhow, they have a couple topping around, so I'm gonna change up lures now. Um, 
we can't get the top one to bite, so we're gonna try something smaller. Um, I have the perfect thing here I want to try. Let me show you what it is. I actually wanted to try uh, one of these Savage Gear shrimps. They're really small, so we're gonna be switching out to light tackle and um, lighter gear. Hopefully that can entice a bite. Uh, you know what I say, if you can't get a bite, time to go light. Oh, no way, us. He's seeing us, you know. Oh, that's it. Savage gear. This is not any savage. <laughs> so believe it or not, Reese actually caught a fish. <laughs> um, we unfortunately didn't get the hookup on video. The camera was running, but it was giving some kind of problem. The video file was corrupted, unfortunately. Um, oh, don't drop your rod, buddy. But uh, he wanted to, oh, drop the fish. He wanted a picture, but it didn't work out because he dropped the fish. Ah, uh, trying to get it back before he got the picture. Next time, Reese. Next time. Oh, he's on it. Oh, he's not on it. I didn't follow it all the way. Oh, but I still can't reach them. Oh, no, oh, it's on me. Yeah, that is not that is not a top one of us. I don't know what it is, but it's not a top one. Yeah, I don't want to walk away. I don't know what it is, but I don't want to lose it. Huh? Me. Wait, taking an airline cap. Well, I don't want to get ski. I don't want to do this. Them. The camera. This fish actually took one of my DOA shrimps. Um, I switched out the Savage Gear for one of the DOA just because it could cast further. I was quite surprised that it ate it. Um, I thought it would have been a little bit too big for bonefish, but apparently they're pretty greedy in these parts. I don't know where he is. I have it there. Uh, Oh, what? All right, that was a 
was a epic little inshore session. We are going to fish deeper water now. Um, Risa and myself going to check out a ledge. Um, we have a friend that's actually in Tobago. He came to surf and um, asked if he could tag along. We told him he's all right. Uh, he could use our gears. So we'll see if he brings us luck or maybe brings himself luck. And uh, we're going to check it out, see what it's like. See how it goes. Oh! It's rough in here. Hey, hey, hey. It's surging, Bretzky. Whoa, we're falling. Go oh, quick before that salary spread. It's coming. Oh, sh. Oh sh! Go, Brett. Oh, it happened. It happened, Maris. Oh, oh Maris! I can't see. Go, Brett. Just f***ing swing foot and f***ing go. I can't see. Oh, that's it. I guess. Hey, watch it! Watch it! Watch it! Watch it! <laughs> <laughs> ah, go let that run go to what's up? Go let that <laughs> Go let that run go there. Oh! Where is it? Oh! And these rocks dry us. Hey! Wow! Big jump! Big jump! Oh! Oh, f shot, if I let him run, shot, let him run, no rough him up, ease him up. Big top on! Whoa! Rough him up, rough him up, rough him up, boss, that! Oh, that ain't gonna bust him up for the rocking or it's. Bring it, shoot! Bring, walk him around this way, walk him around further. Walk him around further. Walk forward, walk forward. Right right yeah, pull, pull him around, pull him around. Walk back now, walk back, walk back. Walk back, walk back. Walk back. Walk back, walk back. Oh, he's going back the next way. Yeah, he's having it. Don't wrap him, don't wrap him, Brad. Just send leader, send leader. Easy, Brad, easy on him. So, just to give you all an idea of what's happening, this is Stuart's first top on. And Reese just told me to be careful with the leader because it's light and I just broke it off. So, a lot of pressure right now. There's a fish that's about to get away and I need to stop it. Oh, it's Brad. Hold it! Hold him, Brett! Hold him, hold him, hold him! Hold him, hold him! Hold him, hold him! Hold him, hold him! Get him up, get him up, get him up! Get him out, get him out! Get him out! Oh! Brett, have him there! Hold him, hold him, hold him! 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 Hold him, hold him, hold I release him, Sean. I release, release him now. We are releasing him now, eh? Yeah, yeah release him. Walk, walk over and show him now, eh? Right now, yeah. Let him go out there. Alright, let him go out there. Come, come, let's see. Now, now, watch your hole there, watch your hole there. Good. Now, shoot! Hit, hit. Come on this one. No, no. Now, now. So quick discussion I want to have. The following day I went for a little free dive. 
uh, by one of my favorite spots. I had a really nice time free diving with some stingrays, saw all kind of cool stuff. The water was clean. Um, unfortunately, after the dive or midway through it, I found this. It's basically just an abandoned net. Uh, it's a gill net that people use to catch fish. Um, unfortunately, it was hooked up on a reef. Uh, and uh, you have to keep in mind that there's a lot of life surrounding these reefs. Um, it was a little bit devastating to see that. Uh, so I made a decision to try to move it. But before I did, you know, I got some footage of the fish in the area. They have lizard fish. They have uh, all kind of cool stuff like stingrays. Uh, just check this guy out. It was a really tame stingray for some reason. Um, maybe because somebody was feeding him, but he let me get really close to him. He had some file fish in the area. Just, just look at this guy. Look at him light up. This beautiful fish. So I bundled up the gill net as best as I could. Um, I had a board. I put it on the board and tucked it out of the water and properly disposed of it. Um, thankfully, I had some friends to help me too and my wife. Thank you, Ariane. <laughs> After that, the squids were happy. I was happy. Uh, I met a little uh, hogfish and uh, he wanted to play hide and seek. <laughs> so I was hiding behind a rock and he'll swim away. And when I hide, he'll come and pop over the rock and look at me. Um, it's pretty cool. So keep in mind, guys, that we want to keep a clean scene. Um, for the fishermen that use these nets, just be careful with it. If your net gets stuck on something, try to remove it. Um, if not, try to get somebody that can help you remove it. So again, guys, let's keep a clean scene. See you in the next one. Out.